I'm going to show you today how uh, you can take your Closet Pro software design and export it into Cabinet Vision. You need Cabinet Vision uh, version 11 or greater, and uh, any version of Closet Pro will do. So here I have a design that I've created. Let me just open it up. We can take a look at it in Closet Pro. So it's a fairly interesting design. It's got uh, it's got the seven walls, a little bit of an L shape to it. Uh, just point out some things here in the design. We have 12 inch deep cabinets on wall one and, and wall seven. Uh, on wall one, we put some doors on it. On the side cabinets, on the side walls, we have double hangs that are 14 inches deep. On wall three, we have um, standard 84 height, 14 deep shoe fence, and then these two drawer units are actually 18 deep and 90 inches tall. They also extend past the wall, as you can see here. So we can show you how that works. Uh, as we go around the room, we have sh uh, flat shelves. In the back, we have shoe shelves. On the right-hand side, we have some wall hung hang units. And on the front right wall, we have some top cabinets with some doors. So if we look at what this looks like in, in our tool, in our design tool, we can walk into this. You can see what we have here. We have the deeper units here. They're extending beyond the wall. We have some short cabinets over there. Up here on the wall, we have some, tall, some um, top cabinets with doors. If we look at the overhead, you can see how that's all laying out. And that's what we have for in Closet Pro. So once we have this job uh, set up in order to take it to cab division, what we're going to do is just click the CV11 button. It takes only a second really for us to create the XML file, which is right here. I'm then going to go to my CV11. So this is my uh, version 11 of Cabin Vision. I'm going to open that job up. So when you click the open button, you're going to default to looking for your job files. We're going to change that to look for an XML order entry file. That creates, uh, that shows all the jobs that are waiting here. This, this is the one we just created uh, at 8.05 in the evening. I'm going to go ahead and double click on that. It's going to take a, about a minute for Cabinet Vision to pull that in. In the meantime, just want to show you the way this is going to work for you. Is we do provide you with a Closet Pro parts catalog. It's packaged up. We can send it to you. It's easy to add to your own. Uh, this is the catalog editor for Cabinet Vision. You can see that inside here we just have some parts defined that are standard Cabinet Vision parts. And when those parts hit the screen, then you'll be able to. Um, have your UCSs applied to them and, and send them right to your S2M and your optimizer. Just to pop back here real quick into Closet Pro, this customer's name is Bob Davis. And if we look at his information, he's got a mailing address or shipping address here as well. And I just want to show you that because that will be brought over to Cabinet Vision <clears throat> as well. So this is finishing up here with the loading into Cabinet Vision. When it loads up, we're going to see that it draws all the walls, just like we had in Closet Pro, and, and here we are. So here's the seven walls that have been drawn just as if we drew them ourselves. If I go to the Job tab, we can see that the customer's information has been brought in. Email address, phone number is all set up in the job file. <clears throat> here we see the job here. These units here are 12 inches deep, as they were in ours, and they have doors on them. Here you can see as we come across the back, these units are deeper and taller. And we wrap around the side here, and these are wall hung units. Let's take a look at that in, in a 3D view. Uh, let's change that to wire mode. So you can see if we just tilt it up a little bit how things are all laid out. We have connector shelves in the corners. We have the shelving drawer units here, or I'm sorry, the drawer units that are taller and deeper. Let's take a look at these individually. So this is wall one. So you can see we have a shelving unit with double doors on it. Wall two, 14 inch deep, 84 tall. Wall three, these are shoe fence shelves. And if I click into that, you'll see they're being recognized just like you would expect. So those are shoe shelves. This is an adjustable shelf. And as you come back out, you'll see we have the drawer units, and you see how they extend past the actual wall. And then we have the flat shelves. In the back, we have some more shoe shelves. Here you see the wall-hung units with the elevations. 
And finally on the return wall, the two 12 inch deep top units with two shelves and cabinets on there. So that's how the uh, export works. It's very simple, uh, works great. So if you, um, if you have Cabinet Vision in your shop, this is a great way to be able to take your Claus Pro designs and load them into Cabinet Vision and can either continue working with them or send them right to your machine. Thank you.